Hi and welcome to this track pass tutorial. In this tutorial we will show you how to replace an oil filter of small Iseki tractors. These are the tools that you need to get the job done. A wrench, a filter wrench, a tube with some oil and of course the new oil filter. Looking for the right parts for your tractor? We have more than 14,000 parts in stock and worldwide shipping. Please visit trackparts.com and find the parts you need. New to this channel? Please subscribe, hit the bell and get notified to new videos. Alright, let's get started. First off, remove the engine cover. Get your dip tray and place it beneath the oil pan. Unscrew the nut from the oil pan and drain the oil into the dip tray. In the meantime, grab the wrench and the filter wrench. You can loosen the oil filter by hand. If the filter is stuck, use a filter wrench. When releasing the old oil filter, there might leak some oil here. Then take the new oil filter with the tube of oil. Lubricate the rubber ring with some oil so that it fits nicely when tightened and does not start to leak. Tighten the new filter by hand and make sure you don't force it. When it's tight, it's good. Also, replace the rubber ring of the nut of the oil pan so that you reduce the risk of leaking. Replace the nut in the oil pan and tighten it securely using the wrench. Then it's time to refill the tractor with oil. From our experience we know that this tractor takes about 3 liters, but always check the oil dipstick when filling. Once checked and you're done, screw the oil dipstick back on. Check the current hours on the tractor and write down when the filter and oil can be replaced again. Last step, put the engine cover back on. And that's it, you replace an oil filter. Need more tips? Watch our other videos and share the knowledge. Thanks for watching this track pass tutorial. Until next time.